I'll get you more on the story in just a moment, but I quickly want to cut across to Delhi's Patiala House Courts. You have Professor S.A.R. Gilani. He is being produced in court again, charged with sedition. Former Delhi University professor. He was in the eye of a storm over parliament attack. That's Professor S.A.R. Gilani. You can see him in these pictures. There was an, a program on Afzal Guru at Delhi's press club and he was at that function. Anti-India slogans were reportedly chanted even at this function. We will wait and get you more on details of his interrogation. He was picked up late last night and questioned by the Delhi police. He's now been arrested and he is being produced in court. S.A.R. Gilani and another organizer of this event. Now, from the Parliament Street Police Station where he was questioned, he is now being taken to Delhi's Patiala House Courts. The police have to produce him before they seek his remand. Now, sources in Delhi Police have told India today that they've sought his remand. They want to question him even further in connection with the anti-India chants at the Delhi Press Club. So two different events. What happened at JNU was different. What happened here is different. And I want to bring in Deputy Editor Atir Khan. Atir has been tracking the story very, very closely. Atir, tell us more about what has S.A.R. Gilani been charged with? Well, uh, he has, uh, uh, has also been charged with similar sections uh, which have been, uh, you know, attracted in the case of uh, Kanaya. Uh, these are sections of uh, pertaining to sedition, uh, uh, criminal conspiracy, and uh, these are basically regarding the event which was held on the press club on Tuesday, where uh, he had raised, uh, allegedly raised slogans uh, hailing Afzal Guru, and uh, it was in, uh, you know, support of uh, uh, agitation against it, and therefore uh, the police had taken two motor cognizance. They had placed all evidence on record. Now they already have. Uh, uh, some record which indicates his involvement. He was arrested late uh, early this morning and uh, now the police uh, we, we are learning from sources will take him to Patiala House Court to be produced in the court where the court is going to, uh, where the police is going to seek two days custody of uh, S.A.R. Gilani because they want to take him for custodial interrogation uh, they, there are certain uh, information they want him to reveal. Okay. Now, Atir, You've been tracking the story very closely. Is there a link between S.A.R. Gilani's event at Press Club and the anti-India chant and pro Afzal Guru chants at JNU? Is there any link to both these events, Atir? Well, at this point of time, Gaurav, uh, it cannot be said with certainty whether there's a pattern to it, whether it's a synchronized, uh, you know, sort of uh, event which happened... Uh, uh, one after the other, uh, but uh, yes, certainly the intelligence inputs uh, uh, suggest that there is uh, effort uh, on the part of certain people uh, to to rake up this issue, uh, which has already been settled by the highest court of the country. So, um, uh, you okay. know, even so, so these, these there are indications, but whether these two were synchronized or whether they have any uh, connection, cannot okay. be. Uh, Arthur, keep tracking that story. I will come back to you for more. The Delhi Police Commissioner B.S. Bassi, the Delhi Police is claiming that there is clear evidence against the JNU Students Union President Kanahiya Kumar. Police Commissioner B.S. Bassi saying that there is clear proof.